are in San Francisco with Gatsby here celebrating his ninth birthday. All the dogs in the Bay Area come to Mishka Dog Boutique for their birthday. Are you ready, Gatsby? Dog owners travel far and wide to treat their fur babies to the incredible and all-natural dog treats at Mishka. Have you ever seen such beautiful handmade treats? This is the perfect place to celebrate your dog's birthday and the owner Olia always goes out of her way to make each dog feel so special. We tried to do our best to oh like... Oh my god! Provide SV so, picture! Oh my god! <laughs> she made this special cake out of beef just for Gatsby. The corgi in the center is made out of agar agar, carrot juice and coconut milk. The colors are all natural. Purple cauliflower, which gave us beautiful blue pigments. Yellow is golden beets, carrot is the orange one, white is the coconut milk. So as usual, never anything artificial at all. Olia makes these treats using chicken, lamb or beef pate and then covers it in agar agar gelatin which is so good for the joints. Guess we got a little sample of this Lunar New Year carp cake. Oh, you wanna try that piece? Here you go. <laughs> Olia also had some handmade beef oh, jerky wow. for Gatsby. Human grade! Gatsby, no way! I'll try one. Oh, seriously, it's really good. It's just long and broad and nothing else. It's pretty good. <laughs> After the tasting, Olia showed us the party room in the back with so many great photo ops. You can see she put so much love and work into her new store. Gatsby had such a great time, I could tell he felt so special. If you're ever in the area, I'd highly recommend you check them out. Gatsby, are you ready to try your birthday cake? Happy birthday, dear Gatsby. Happy birthday to you. Oh my gosh. I posted I mentioned that Gatsby had some problems with his adrenal glands. A few days ago I brought Gatsby in to our local vet to get that eight hour blood test done. It was so stressful and then after that we had to wait a few days to get the results in and I was so stressed out those past few days but I do have some good news and the good news is that Gatsby tested negative for Cushing's disease. After that eight hour blood test, it was negative. What that means is that Gatsby's tumor that's in his adrenal glands is non-functioning. So what that also means is that when he has to get it out, it'll there'll be less complications. That is a little bit of a relief. However, it also means that they don't even know what the tumor is and we're just gonna have to go with that. So the next step in Gatsby's treatment is we are going to be taking him back to Davis to get a CT scan so they can fully scan his abdominal region and also his nose. And that's coming up soon. I'm kinda nervous about that too. So that will be the next step. So far Gatsby's doing really well as you can see. He um, is full of energy so hopefully the CT scans reveal really good things. Just keeping my fingers crossed. That's the update. Today we are just going to be celebrating Gatsby's birthday. We're not going to worry too much about the cancer. I thought I would just give you guys an update on what's been going on. Other than that though, we are going to continue on with Gatsby's birthday. <laughs> 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 
It's time for us to open some presents that our fans sent you. This is from Karen from Alhambra, California. Oh my gosh, look at that. Ta-da! Are any of you guys born in the year of the rabbit? If you are, this year you're gonna be turning 12 or 24 or 36 or any of those, you know, the multiple of 12. Let us know in the comments if this is your year. Let's open the next one here from Lynn from Los Altos, Gatsby. Look at this. It's a little bit tight. Yeah, thanks, Lynn. From Allison. Oh, Gatsby. <laughs> we have included our Westie's favorite dog treat, Trader Joe's Just Salmon Skin Baked Treats. One by one. This is all the way from St. Petersburg, Russia, from Anna. Look at that artwork. Gatsby looks so beautiful. This is from Dorothy the Frenchie from Sacramento. Lunar New Year dog toys. Look, you're the rabbit. <laughs> and the red envelope, go. This is from A. Price and T. Bailey from Wisconsin. Wow, oh, look at this, the Brewers. Good boy. <laughs> from Finn, Wilbur, and Chen from Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. A bok choy palm tree dog toy. Oh my gosh, look at this ukulele one. Donut ornament. That's cute. Yeah. If you have a corgi, you know what this is, right? Brian and Maxine are the ones. Brian owns the corgi. You know Maxine, who is always in the backpack? Look at you. Ta -da! <laughs> what do you think? I want to thank everyone for sending us Gatsby some birthday gifts. Gatsby, you're such a loved special doggy, huh? And let's continue on with the vlog. Happy birthday! So usually around this time of the year, we release our Valentine's merchandise. This year though, as you guys know, it's been like really rough. I wasn't able to come up with a new Valentine's card this year. If you have not had the chance yet, you can still get the last year and the year before that's Valentine's card. If you want, I have a few left. I have a few other things that I actually was working on for Christmas time that I'm releasing now just because it got delayed, including these Keeping It Classy t-shirts in the super high quality comfort colors tees and they're available in five different colors. I'm also restocking the year of the Corgi t-shirts including in a new navy color. The dad hats are also getting restocked. A lot of people really liked this lanyard so I'm releasing it in the wrist lanyard form. And finally our new product that it was supposed to come out during Christmas time, but it got delayed. I am still waiting for it to come, but it is coming any day now. It is a Gatsby plush keychain. Ta-da! Super cute. It's a Gatsby plush keychain. It even gets this white scarf mark. Extra cute. It will also come with a Gatsby official tag. This was just the prototype, so it doesn't have the tag. Looks pretty good, right? I will put it up for pre-order, and they'll start shipping out when I get them, which should be any day now. I will be restocking the original Gatsby plushes, but it is gonna take like a few more months to arrive. It does take a long time to do those. So that is our Valentine's merchandise drop. Make sure to grab some merchandise. All of the proceeds are going to help pay for Gatsby's cancer treatment, including like his surgery, that eight hour blood test, the CT scans and everything like that. So if you enjoy our content and you want to support us, make sure to go to corgionfleek.com at the end of the video. And let's get on with the vlog. Birthday. Birthday, birthday. Gatsby, are you excited? We're almost here. Let's go. Look at his long shadow legs. <laughs> For Gatsby's birthday, I took him to Communication Hill. It has a beautiful view of the South Bay. And because it has been raining so much, everything is so green. It really was a perfect day. So clear. We really took the time to enjoy each other's company. I also brought along the backpack to try out. And look at that view. Wow. Communication Hill has the grand staircase. 
Gatsby and I climbed all 252 steps to the top. There we are! It was so special to spend the golden hour here watching the sunset with my best pal. And as we headed back, I felt the appreciation from Gatsby, as if to say, thanks for taking me here. I loved it. We are back home. We're gonna do a doggy hot pot. Some vegetables and some Japanese pumpkin kabocha. Gatsby's thinly sliced meat. And then I have mine over here. I'm gonna add some kombu. This is Japanese dried seaweed. It adds umami to the flavor. He's all excited. Hot pots. For the human portion, I have ponzu sauce. It's like a citrusy soy sauce. It's super good. It should cook like immediately. And then I'm just gonna cut it up. Look at that, Gatsby. Look. Look at the meat. Look. What we're going to do is take it out and put it in cold water to stop the cooking so that he doesn't burn his tongue. Okay. He's all excited. Are you ready? Here it is. you some more. We have a whole thing for you. We're gonna start boiling the pumpkin because that's gonna take some time. We'll do some veggies too at the same time. This is for me. Oh, it's good. I'll make one for Gatsby again. There we go. Yep, I'm making it for you. There you go. Pumpkin is done, so we got Japanese pumpkin here. There you go, Gatsby. Mm. Happy birthday, I hope you had a good birthday dinner. He ate a whole plate of beef all for himself. That's like one human's portion. By the way, check it out you guys, I got new lights. Okay. okay. I hope you had a wonderful birthday, Gatsby. I hope you had a wonderful day. I tried to make it as great as possible for you. Uh, you guys, um, you know, I've been going through a really hard time and just thought I would let you guys know that. Gatsby's going in for his um, CT scan incredibly soon, so we're gonna see what happens with that. Please send us some more good vibes. <sighs> and uh, check out our Valentine's merchandise launch. <sighs> Other than that though, we're gonna head to bed. Keep everything positive and just hope really good thoughts. Please keep Gatsby in your thoughts. And yes, we'll see you guys in the next video. Good night. Hey Gatsby, check out this awesome fan. I have some bad news. There's some good news, but 